It's a complicated situation. And so meanwhile, Jack just stays frozen in a stasis pod down there? He sacrificed himself to save us, all of us, not just this country. Look, okay, I know what he means to the three of you. We all appreciate the sacrifice Colonel O'Neill made. You're our best chance at deciphering whatever information's in that ancient outpost. I schooled. What does it say? It says he wants to arrange a meeting for the purpose of negotiating a treaty. System wars. I want you to reconsider my request. Right now, that is the most advanced piece of technology we have. If it weren't for Colonel O'Neill, we wouldn't have that ship. For that matter, we wouldn't even be here discussing this. One, two, one, two, one, two, testing. Hello? The Asgard can help him. Thor, you're the only one who can save Colonel O'Neill. I must wait here until I am certain the replicators have been destroyed. Major Carter. Fifth. I imagine you're expected to see me again. Where's Sam? She was captured by the replicators. The replicators escaped from the time dilation device and are threatening to destroy the Asgard. You gained my trust, then you used me and left me behind. It wasn't my decision. How many planets are protected with this treaty? Six, only seven if you include Earth. They've been recalled because the system wars have decided to test their defenses. They're sending a ship to attack Earth. They'll be here within the hour. If we fail, you will be O'Neill's only hope. Thor believes the ancient knowledge stored in O'Neill's mind may be the key to defeating the replicators once and for all. Take it easy, you've been through a lot. Can you pinpoint her location? You okay, something wrong? Yes, everything. I'm trying to stop us. I'm trying to save me. 